Hey guys, it's Stetson here again with another video, and this time it's something that I'm interested in, and it's uh, the newest news. Um, I look at transfer market a lot, and it's Hugo Rodiaga going to Arsenal possibly. Now this may be a su surprise, and yes, it's pretty huge because I mean this is just a I would say an average striker for a pretty average team. Um, quick look at Hugo Rodiaga. He's 25 years old, Colombian and a striker um, he scored 22 goals for Wigan in the past two or three years he scored nine goals this season ten goals last season and two goals in cup games um, internationally he scored eight goals but none recently his last of date was 2008 um, next we have how he plays um, I think Kudo or Hugo, Hugo Radiega is um, I'm tactically aware his positioning seems to be good and in the box he tends to get very lucky because of his positioning and you'll see that in, uh, in these clips I'm about to show you from this YouTube video um, he can create opportunities on opponents mistakes as you can see there's like two goals that he scored this season that are where the goalkeeper punted it and he just I mean initialized on the moment so to say um last season as I said he scored 9 goals 1 assist and 142 shots um I don't think that's too impressive but you can see he's fairly consistent with the amount of goals per year per year um, 142 shots is a lot, and all he got out of it was 9 goals. I don't know what the percent on that is, but it's not very high. Oh, God. So, let's see. I went to this one website that estimates the transfer like value of players in the league, and he is estimated to be around 6.6 .6 million pounds, or 9.42 million dollars. Um, let's see. As he still has contract with Wigan, contract with Wigan still left, his value will probably rise, so they don't have to do the buyout clause and everything. So, his transfer deal could go up to $12 million, which is a lot. So, overall, I'd have to say, if you're a Wigan fan, I would be sad as he is a very good player who can initialize on uh, moments of the game. But if I was an Arsenal fan, I would be a little disappointed too, because this is not the quality that Arsenal needs right now. After finishing, I don't know. It was I don't know. That Arsenal didn't finish as high as they usually do last year, and, and this just seems to be a downfall. And I really hope this doesn't happen. But yeah, that's about it. So I think I'll be making more of these videos as transfer deals go on, and just keep a notice. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks. It's Stetson.